A very warm welcome to everyone. Today we will be sitting for a meditation as guided by the Divine on the new earth and the solar eclipse. As all of you know, the solar eclipse is an eclipse which is very powerful, very potent and its energies affect us for the next six months. If we count it from here, October, November, December, January, February, March. By March, many of you will feel a significant shift in your life. There will be a new dimension opening up for you. Obviously, if you are on the right path and if you are following what you are supposed to follow. So as per divine guidance, we'll start the meditation today. But before we start the meditation, I request all of you to close your eyes and start breathing in and breathing out slowly and softly, relaxing yourself, relaxing yourself and relaxing yourself. Breathing in divine light, breathing out all that is not serving us. And as we are breathing in this divine light and breathing out all that is not serving us, let us bring back with every breath all our scattered energies, all our lost soul fragments, all our soul power, all our soul essence, rinse, cleanse, and fill with the creator light, creator codes, to integrate it back into a sacred heart center. So from now, as you breathe in and breathe out, you give the intention of bringing back your powers, bringing back your scattered energies, bringing back your soul fragments, bringing back your soul essence. And as you breathe in and you breathe out, you breathe in the divine light, the divine energies. You integrate your energies into your being and you breathe out all that is not serving you. As we bring back our scattered energies to ourselves, let us bring back to us all our soul fragments, all our soul energies and everything that we have lost, be it our soul lessons, be it our soul gifts, everything that is scattered across the universe through the different timelines, through the different lifetimes that we have been through. Let us bring it all back to us, all back to us, all back to us. We are breathing in the divine light, we are breathing out all that is not serving us. And as you keep on breathing in and breathing out, allowing your energies to slowly settle down, allowing 
a deep calmness, a deep relaxation to flood your being. I request you to do this deep breathing continuously as I invoke the divine. So let us now invoke Parampita Parmeshwar, the creator of all creators, the divine source energy. We bow down before the Parampita with deep reverence, deep love, deep gratitude, requesting your divine presence, requesting your divine blessings on this meditation. Please support us to release what we need to release, to integrate what we need to integrate. Let us bow down before our Father God, our Mother God, the light lineage from which we have come. Let us bow down before Lord Shiva Mahashakti, Lord Vishnu, Ma Lakshmi, Lord Brahma, Ma Saraswati. We bow down before Lord Ganesha, Lord Kartike, Lord Hanumanji. We bow down before Lord Sun, Mother Moon, all the mighty galaxy star systems, every divine nakshatra, every divine planet. We bow down before every god and goddesses across all lokas, across all creation of the highest love and light to be present with us. We invoke all Guru Sant Mahatmas, all Galactic Masters, Star Masters, Masters of the highest of the highest realms, we invoke thee and request your divine presence with us. We invoke the angelic realms, the unicorn collectives, the dragon collectives, the celestial whales, dolphins, mermaids, fairies, the divine Taramandal energies, the divine Trishul energies. We invoke the divine essence of every ray, every consciousness, every frame. And as we bow down before all these divine energies, we are aligning ourselves to Parampita, we are aligning ourselves to our teams of light, bowing down before them with deep reverence, deep love, deep gratitude. We bow down before our higher self and invoke them to be with us. And we now ground ourselves in a golden disc or lotus, whatever is present for you below your earth star chakra and grounding ourselves there, we connect ourselves above to Parampita Parmeshwar, forming a pillar of light, pillar of light, pillar of light. We are in this pillar of light divinely sealed, divinely cocooned, divinely protected in a special grid of protection, healing, releasing, and clearing. And as we are divinely sealed and cocooned, no other energies can come in and disturb us as we do this meditation. So feel your pillar of light and breathe in and breathe out with deep reverence. the formation of the new earth. 
a lot of energies are in a great upheaval. Pralaya has started. It started from the time before COVID. With slow and steady steps, it is taking the earth on a journey of destruction. On a journey where we know that things will no longer be the same. Things are changing each and every day. We can see the destruction. We can see the destruction of the darkness. A lot of negativity is coming to the surface and positivity is replacing it even though it may not be very visible to us right now or we may not even understand it. But things are changing with slow and steady steps the new earth is building a lot of the new energies are already on earth but we still have to wait because a lot of negativity still needs to release but how will this negativity release if we are not ready to release from ourselves so this solar eclipse which is a very powerful, very potent eclipse, opens up for us deep possibilities of transformation. As the deep work is done on Mother Gaia, let us do this deep work on ourselves, creating a newer and a better versions of ourselves. So let us sit together holding hands, surrounded by the energies and a divine grid of the Lord, Sun and the Mother Moon, as they surround us, forming a special grid for us, so that we are supported by the power of the Lord, Sun, and we are supported by the divine healing qualities of the Mother Moon so that we can recognize our powers and so that we can heal all the broken aspects of ourselves which we have not been able to heal till now. First of all, dear ones, let us start by healing our relationships. The pain of the relationships buried deep within us. All the compromises, all the adjustments we make to relationships out of our neediness, out of our pain, out of our longing, out of our fear to be alone. It is time to release that. It is time to release that. It is time to release that. It is time to understand that we can no longer compromise. We can no longer compromise with our authenticity, with what we believe to be true, with what is the truth. And we can no longer compromise and suppress ourselves, suppressing our divinity, suppressing our purity, suppressing authenticity. So if our relationships cannot take the brunt of this authenticity of ours, this purity within us, this truth, this honesty, let us vow to ourselves to be more detached. And even if possible, to let go of all the relationships which are no longer serving us. Allow your system to release from you all the energies of the pain, 
of all relationships, all the energies of all the pain, of sadness, unhappiness, everything that is not serving you through timelines, through lifetimes, where we have gone on suppressing, gone on people pleasing, gone on longing and being needy in your relationship, suppressing your truth, suppressing your true feelings, suppressing your authenticity. The time has come to release such toxic relationships. Let us be free to release, release and release and set the intention for pure, authentic relationships in our lives. Let us allow these energies of negativity to move out of us and let the manifestation of pure, authentic relationships start for us now. We are releasing the deep-seated traumas of inauthentic, toxic relationships. We are allowing a soul to let go, let go, let go of all that does not serve us. We are allowing all suppression to release, all pain to release, all trauma to release. And as we are allowing these to release, let us go back and release from the deepest of the deepest cores, all belief systems, all conditionings of earth, which is not allowing us to be the truest version of a true authentic self. The self, which is our higher self, the self from which we all come, so let us pray to the divine to help us release from us all toxicity, all negativity, all belief systems which are outdated, which are harmful and which are not serving us, all conditionings, all programmings by society which are not serving us, let us release let us release, let us release. And as we release these old conditionings, these old programmings, these old belief systems, we are paving the way for the true beliefs, the true authentic path of living to unfold for us. So let us sit in silence for one minute Releasing this old conditionings, releasing this old belief systems, releasing this old programmings, so that we can invite into our being a new way of living, a new set of belief systems which will serve us to move forward in a spiritual journey. Breathe in and breathe out allowing things to release from the deepest of your deepest cores.
as the new earth is opening up before us, as the divine energies are coming into earth, let us understand the time for separation is over. The time for I and you and me is no longer there. It is a time of unified consciousness. It is a time of understanding in our divinity, in our oneness, in our truth, in our authenticity. So this walls of separation, this deep walls of separation that we hold with anyone other than our loved ones. It is the time for them to crumble. It is the time for us to understand that we need to release, release and release all these preconceived notions that we separate. We have to understand our oneness. We have to understand unconditional love. We have to understand empathy, sympathy, compassion, forgiveness. We have to understand that without forgiveness, we cannot move forward. Because everyone in our own journeys have created karma, have made mistakes. So who are we to judge? So let us release judgment. And as we release all negativities, all judgments, all separation, let us bow the seeds of oneness, of acceptance, of surrender to the divine will. Let us seed ourselves with the seeds of compassion, forgiveness, truth, honesty. Let us remove from us this little me and fill us with the big me. Breathe in and out as you release the separation tendencies. This tendency to be a small person of you, not aligning yourself to your higher self. Let us now invite into our being unconditional love, compassion, forgiveness, oneness, truth, honesty. For the next minute, breathe in and out, releasing the old patterns, the old paradigms. has come for us to understand that we are no longer the old version of, of ourselves. So all the burdens, all pains, all traumas, just hand it over to your guides and walk the new path, walk the path of your true authentic self. It is a time to download into us our true qualities, 
our true gifts, our true perfection, our true knowledge. So as we sit here in this eclipse meditation, releasing the old, we welcome the new into our life. Request our higher self and our guides to show us what is a true authentic self, what is a true soul qualities, what is a life mission on earth, why is it that we have come down? Connect to your soul wisdom, connect to your soul power, connect to your soul energies. Every day, sit in deep meditation, asking your guides to open up your clairs, open up your visions, release all veils of illusion and connect to your own true authentic self, filled with divine wisdom, filled with divine power, filled with divine strength. So let us pave the way in this meditation to open up inside us our true powers, our true gifts, our soul qualities, our divine wisdom, so that we can recognize, so that we can understand what is our life path, what is our soul mission, because the divine has released for us toxic patterns, old belief systems, old ancestral patterns, old traumas, old sadness, old behavior patterns, emotional patterns, habits, belief systems, which are not serving us. And the divine now asks you to open yourself up to receive your higher wisdom, your higher knowledge, your higher gifts, your soul truth, your soul clarity, your soul path. So let us see this new moon, this divine solar eclipse and promise to ourselves, promise to divine that we will be the highest versions of ourselves. our true authentic self, speaking words of wisdom, speaking words of kindness, doing deeds of goodness, doing deeds of kindness, love, service. So let us see this into our divine souls, into our divine beings, let this go deep within and create a new you, a new you, a new you. Allow the old to flow out of you, flow out of you, flow out of you. Embrace the new, embrace the new, embrace the new.
Let us release the old wounds that are in our system, be it humiliation, be it betrayal, be it rejection, be it low self-esteem, be it low self-worth. Whatever is holding us back, we are now sitting here in front of Lord Sun, and with his energies, with his power, he is reviving our solar plexus, giving us the confidence, giving us the strength in every cell so that we can be a better version of ourselves. And Mother Moon, with her gentleness, is healing us of all old wounds, trauma, pain, sadness, loneliness, making us a better version of ourselves, making us our true divine being with truth, with honesty, with purity. We are walking our divine path, full of the divine wisdom, knowledge, honesty, purity, authenticity. We are opening up like a lotus, full of the divine knowledge, healing old traumas, healing old pains, and creating a new version of ourselves. This is the perfect situation where we are ready to imbibe our soul truth, our soul knowledge, our soul wisdom, and walk the path of divinity. A deep love and blessings to all of you. May your soul heal from the old wounds, old traumas, old patterns, and may you find the new you, the better version of you. Breathe in and out, keep on releasing, and keep on integrating the new energies, the new powers, the new soul gifts that are coming down to you. Receive and integrate, receive and integrate, receive and integrate. My love and blessings to all of you. Thank you for joining me in this meditation. Keep on breathing in and out, releasing the old, integrating the new. Releasing the old, integrating the new. Releasing the old, integrating the new. Love and blessings to you. We are new tomorrow and new you. Thank you.